It was crazy yesterday. The whole internet was in quarantine, okay? Divine Eats. Divine Eats. Uh, uh, come eat with me. Come sit with me. Put that food up on the plate and dig in with me. It's Divine Eats. Divine. What's up, Z crew? So it's your girl Divine Eats, and today, y'all, it's another seafood mukerabang. And today, I am having some red king crab legs, some corn, some eggs, some shrimp, and my sausage is buried under here somewhere. I do got my cocktail sauce back here, as well as my good up, good up, them lemon. And I got my ice cold iced tea. Y'all know I normally drink water, but baby, um, mother needs some iced tea to go with this meal. So I'm gonna go ahead and say grace, and we gonna jump right into it. Heavenly Father, thank you for this food. Let this food be nourishment to my body, Father God. Bless the hands that prepared this food, Father God. Father God, in Jesus' name that I pray, amen. So, guys, I am super excited. This is the first mukbang since the name change, and y'all, I'm ready to dig in. I am hungry. That tea is nice and sweet. I got my scissors over here. I got my little bowl over here to put my trash in. Squeeze my lemon on here. Because if you don't have no lemon with your seafood, girl, what are you doing? I'm going to get that. So, I hope everyone is doing well. I'm going to go ahead and eat some and we're going to chop it up. So, let me take my mountain. I'm down. Ooh, chill. My shrimp trying to get away. And my egg chill. Take this little mountain. Move that. That should be good. I think I'm going to start off. Oh, God. Y'all, I ain't do a thumbnail. See? I know I was forgetting something. Let me do my thumbnail. Okay, hey, y'all. I don't know how my thumbnail is going to come out, but I don't care. I'm ready to dig in. Your girl is hungry, hungry. This is like my first meal of the day. My first biggest meal of the day. So, y'all go ahead and get a bite of that egg. I just want to apologize in advance just in case you guys hear some construction going on. They are doing construction where I live at as always. Mm. Y'all, this egg tastes so good. Mmm. Mm. 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 And this cocktail sauce is good. Mmm. 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 That's the bomb. Mmm. Look at that, y'all. That juicy cocktail sauce. Mmm. 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 Got my sausage, y'all. Mmm. 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 Mm. Mm. That's busting, busting, baby. Mm. 
And that corner is good too. I think it has something to do with the way I cooked it. Shit, I'm about to cut my finger. And you're all that good up, good up meats. Look at that. Mmm, ain't no fat on this, baby. Get my lemon. I don't think I ever had red king crab, but y'all go ahead and take a bite. Go ahead and take a bite. Mmm. 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 Mm -hmm. I did that. Mm hmm. That tastes good. Oh, that tastes good. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. That tastes good. So I hope everybody is doing okay. Y'all. Yesterday was crazy. It was crazy yesterday. The whole internet was in quarantine. Okay. Facebook. Instagram. WhatsApp. And there was another app. That was messing up. Mmm. People said Mark lost about, I think, $7 million or $7 billion in seconds. I'm like, oh my God. Mm. That kibasa sauce says good. I thought yesterday my phone was bugging. I thought then I thought it was my internet. I'm like, I know I pay my bills. I'm like, my phone bill is paid. My cable bill is paid. What is going on? I restarted my phone. Restarted the the um the Wi-Fi and everything. I'm like, oh my God. And then that's when I went on Twitter. You know, Twitter. You know everything on Twitter. And then that's when I found out everything was down. But y'all, I was stressed. I felt like I ain't had no communication with the outside world. Mm. I don't know how people that um, survive. Hopefully y'all can see me. I hope my head ain't cut off. I don't know how people survive with no electronics. Like, oh my God. So I was just on Facebook. Mm, not Facebook. I was just on um, YouTube. Binge watching other mukbangers. There was a couple of um, new mukbangers I found. And I started watching their content. Baby, did it come out? Did all of it come out? Look at that me. Mm. Mm. I want to make sure I ain't leaving no crab left behind. It looked 
somewhat empty. But baby, king crab is too much. Too much. Uh, um, too too expensive to be throwing meat away. Nope. See, I knew I left some meat up in there. I need all my meat. Okay, all my meat. Mm. Now I have to dash that way. Mmm. No. This food tastes so good. Mmm. This corn is good. Mmm. But y'all, I'm going to tell y'all how I missed my blessing yesterday. This is why it's always good to read your receipt before you walk out the store, okay? So, yesterday I went to Target to um, exchange something. And I just wanted to go in there and... I exchanged what I needed to exchange, and, oh, excuse me, leave out, but, I walked past the kids section, and they was having, like, a little sale on their shirts, so I went and I grabbed Harmony for shirts, so, I went to customer service, I did my exchange, I purchased the stuff that I, I was going to purchase or whatever because I had some extra stuff in my cart. I went and purchased that. I left out the store. So now I get downstairs. And I'm in the line for the, um, for the, um, the taxi or whatever. Yeah, I like to eat these little parts last. So I'm in the line. I'm in the line for the um the taxi or whatever. Now what I had to return, I had some Target rewards. So um the girl was like, Oh, the rewards is gonna take about um twenty four hours to two days to um to be back to you see it back on your your um your Target account. So I'm like, okay, cool, no problem. This one got fat on it. So I'm like, okay, cool, no problem. So I'm standing in the line and looking, and when I'm looking, standing in the line and looking in the um the Target app, and I notice, mm, this crap makes me so good. I noticed they had a coupon if you spend $15 on apparel and something else, you'll get $5 off. So I'm like, okay, cool, no problem. So I go back upstairs. I asked the girl. I was like, well, I just noticed y'all had a coupon. I had a coupon in my cart. Well, can I return the shirts and repurchase them so I can use the coupon? So she's like, okay, cool, no problem. So I'm like, okay. I give her the, the shirts, take all the shirts out the bag, give her the shirts, give her the receipt. The receipt. So she's like, oh, um, do you have another receipt? I'm like, no, why? She was like, oh, there's only two shirts on this receipt. So I'm looking at her like, um, ma'am, what you mean two shirts? I put four shirts on the counter. Like, what you mean two shirts? So I'm like, uh-uh, not today, devil. No, you won't. You won't. Mm -mm, not today. Because all I see on Facebook is I be watching these videos of these, you know, these clear people um, accusing, you know, colored people, not trying to play the race card, but be accusing colored people of stealing stuff out the store. And then they got to call the cops. And I be seeing a whole bunch of those type of videos on, um, on Facebook. Mind you, it was a security guard and a police officer. Um at the door. So I'm like, uh-uh, baby girl, 
check that receipt again. She was like, no, it's only two shirts up here. And I was like, I put, when I came here, I put four shirts on this counter. You probably didn't ring up the shirts. Excuse me. Because I was about this, because if she would have said, oh, no, you took the shirts, I was going to tell her, go get your manager, go get your supervisor, and have them run, have them run them cameras back. Because, uh-uh, y'all not about to sit here and accuse me of stealing no two shirts. But when I say my heart dropped, because all I kept picturing in my head is those videos that I was I be seeing and be watching on Facebook. And I'm like, I'm not about to go to jail for no damn two shirts. So I'm like, you know what? So she then, I was, I told her, I said, look again on the receipt. And then she was like, oh, pull up your, um, pull up my cart, my cartwheel. Because on the Target app, you could see your receipt of the in-store purchase. So I was like, okay. So I pulled it up on the receipt. It shows that it she only scanned two shirts. So I was like, I said it again. I was like, you probably didn't scan the shirts. She was like, oh, I thought it was a return. So I'm like, see, this is how people be getting locked up and be getting accused of stuff because these cashiers be doing their own little thing, be all wrong. And y'all, when I said my heart was pounding because I was like, I'm not finna go to jail. Like, I'm not finna go to jail because that cashier made a mistake. I was like, oh my god. But she rung up the two shirts. And I was able to use my coupon. But y'all, if I would have looked at that receipt, I would have never went back upstairs because that wasn't my fault. You forgot to ring up the shirts. So I missed my blessing. But I'm like, you know what? Everything happens for a reason. So guys, make sure y'all look at your receipts before y'all walk out the store. Okay. You know how many times I done went in stores? Me and my mom went in stores. Yeah. Mm. Done purchase stuff. And then we leave out the store. Look at our receipt. To come to find out the cashier didn't rig up a whole outfit. That's not our problem. We gonna keep it pushing. <laughs> That's not our problem. The cashier, y'all y'all ain't do your job right. And when y'all register short, then y'all like, mm, I don't know what happened. Mmm. Yeah, this will taste so good. But that is all I have for today, guys. If you enjoyed this short mukarabang, don't forget to hit that like button as well as hit that subscribe button so you guys will not miss a video when I upload. But that is it for now. I'll talk to you guys later. Peace.